you begin preparing returns in your office, we suggest reviewing some of the general customization options to better cater your tax office to fit your needs. The office setup within your ProWeb configuration menu is a great place to start. First, let's navigate to the office setup menu. Log in to your ProWeb office. You can easily access your ProWeb office from inside your account hub or access it directly from the ProWeb website. Next, access the configuration menu option from the welcome page. Lastly, select the office setup option from the available list of menus. Office setup is divided into six main categories. Let's start with the first section, office information. Office information controls the basics of your tax office. This includes if the office is active and ready to create returns, the office name, your preferred bank product bank, sales tax to be included on each return, which date should show on the printed return, and whose signature should display on the 8879. The Partner Product section will display the products you signed up for during bank enrollment. Simply select the product from the available dropdown and adjust the add-on fee if you'd like. You can also decide if the product will automatically be added to each return in your office. Under the Office Configuration section, you can fine-tune how you'd like the return preparation to go. If you choose to include a cover page with the printed returns, you can decide which information will be included. If you're offering bank products, you have the choice to include the taxpayer's banking information on the printed return rather than the standard of including the bank product's information. Digital signatures on the 1040 can add a nice touch to the printed return. Allowing this will let your taxpayers see their signature that you've captured for the 1040. You have the option to require signatures on every return in your office to ensure all documents are signed before the return is transmitted. Because of the nature of Form 8888, you must make the decision within configuration to offer it. This form will be unavailable to your office until this choice is made. By default, all ProWeb offices are set to display summary using 1040 view. This view allows you to see a quick summary of the return on an interactive 1040. Many of our customers prefer this to the standard itemized line view. For your printed tax returns, you can control if the preparer name prints on the 1040 and if the ERO address will display on the invoice. If your tax office name differs from the ERO name, you can also choose which name to print on the returns. If your client wants to see their itemized deductions, even if the return is using the standard deduction, you can opt to always print the Schedule A for your clients. TaxLayer ProWeb has a few digital signature solutions, including the ability to capture a signature with your mouse. Signature pads are not required for your tax office. However, if you choose to use one of our supported Topaz signature pads for your office, you must configure it before it can be used. Force Verification IP Address gives you control over where your employees can access the tax office. This feature requires a technical setup and should not be turned on until the office has been set up with static IP addresses and an accurate whitelist has been created. If your tax office sends state returns with bank products when the federal has a bank product, you can choose to default the state to send through bank to save time during preparation. You can set the tax returns to require an email address before the return is transmitted. If you don't wish to capture an email address, you can leave that feature off. For our tax offices who prefer Spanish, you can default your tax returns to Spanish. Similar to email addresses, you can set tax returns to require return tags. If you'd like to know more about return tags, check out our return tag video. For our tax offices with a larger client base, you can control the amount of returns that will display on the client list. It sometimes may be more beneficial to not display every return, especially if the amount of returns is causing your client list to load a little slower. Don't worry, your clients will still be accessible but must be searched for in order to appear. The Office Designee section allows you to determine how the third-party designee information will populate on returns. By default, the third-party designee will pre-filter the preparer on the return. 
However, you can manually enter a specific person if you choose or leave the designee completely blank. The last sections include office address and office phone. This information will pull directly from what was entered in Account Hub. Any additional addresses or phone numbers can easily be added by clicking the blue Add button. Make sure to click Continue when you're done to save all of your changes. With Office Setup complete, your tax office will be more catered towards your needs as a tax professional.